What's going on, everybody? Gerald Alfred here, and I have a quick question for you. When you were younger, what did you want to be when you grow up? Because a lot of times, we already have a deep understanding of what our passion is to where we can see how it can lead us to a better job, a better lifestyle, the lifestyle that we truly want to live. But on the pathway of growing up and getting more responsibilities, getting married, having kids, all of that really gets pushed to the side and we lose track of that. Not to mention we have to put on a mask for work, a mask for church, a mask for the homies, a mask for your family, and then a mask for your spouse. No lie, there's a special mask for your spouse. But truly though, what did you want to do? Because many, many times people who get 40, 50 years old, they're coming to retirement and they still haven't figured out their purpose on this wonderful planet. Now, I'm going to give you a great tip right here. Your purpose is connected to your passion. Your passion is connected entirely down to your true you, who you truly are, the person that you keep hidden deep down, the one that, that, that has hobbies and watches certain shows they don't want anybody to know because they're afraid of the ridicule. Now, the reason I actually shot this video uh, like this is because, you know, if you guys actually see me uh, on the streets or whatnot, I'm probably going to have a stocking cap on. And I don't wear a stocking cap to try to be cool or to try to, you know, look a certain way. I wear a stocking cap because I want waves. You know, I want my hair looking fresh and fly when I do remove this. But this is really the true me. The true me is just the guy that relates and comes across and helps people get to the next level. Now, what I want you to do is I'm going to give you a quick assignment. Take a piece of paper and write down five things that you love to do. I'm just doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Write down five things that you love to do. And in those five things, study and look at them. Just look at them hard. I guarantee you one or two things will pop out, and those are things that you could do every day without ever getting tired of it. Those are your passions. Those are things that are directly connected to your purpose. Once you get back in touch with the true, real you, everything else will certainly fall into place. Now, I'm not going to hold you guys long, so if you got some value out of this, please give this video a thumbs up, and I would love to hear from you, so leave a comment down below. Let me know what your passions are, or maybe if you would like some help getting direction towards living out in your passions and your purposes. It's your boy, Gerald Alford, wishing you joy, happiness, and laughter, hoping you have a blessed one.